This video is about improving your English conversation skills with advanced phrases. These phrases are not only useful for everyday conversation but also in professional settings like interviews, business meetings and presentations. By the end of the video, you will have a better understanding of advanced English phrases and be able to express yourself more clearly and confidently in English. We will explain the meaning of each phrase and give you examples of how to use them in context. We will also give you tips on pronunciation and intonation to help you sound more natural. Join us in the fun and interactive English lesson and let's take your English conversation skills to the next level with these 50 plus advanced phrases. Don't forget to hit the like button, share with your friends and subscribe to our channel for more exciting English learning videos. Here are few examples of the phrases we will cover in this video. It's not my cup of tea. I am on the fence about that. Let's agree to disagree. I am over the moon about it. That's a game changer. It's high time we to cut to the chase. That's beside the point. I couldn't agree more. It's no brainer. I will explain the meaning of each phrase and give you examples of how to use them in context. Let's take your English conversation skills to the next level with these 50 plus advanced phrases. Don't forget to hit the like button, share with your friends and subscribe to our channel for more exciting English learning videos. Let's get started with some useful phrases. I am under the weather. This means you are feeling sick or unwell. I am swamped with work. This means you are very busy with work and have a lot to do. It slipped my mind. This means you forgot something. Let's touch base later. Let's touch base later. This means let's talk later or have a follow up. I am all ears. I am all ears. This means you are listening attentively and are ready to hear with to hear what someone has to say. It's a long shot. This means something is unlikely to happen or succeed. I am over the moon. This means you are extremely happy are excited about something. That's a deal breaker. This means something is unacceptable and would make would make you not want to continue with something. Let's call it a day. This means let's stop doing something for the day. I am on the fence. This means you are undecided are unsure about something. It's not my cup of tea. This means something is not to your liking or preference. It's a blessing in disguise. This means something that appears to be bad initially but turns out to be good in the end. It's a no-brainer. This means something is very obvious or easy to understand. That's some music to my ears. This means you are happy to hear something or it's pleasing to you. 
I am in the same boat. This means you are in similar situation as someone else. Let's agree to disagree. This means you acknowledge that you have different opinions and decide to move on from the topic. It's not rocket science. This means something is not very difficult or complicated to understand. That's a weight off my shoulders. This means you are relieved or happy to have something off your mind. I am on the top of the world. This means you are extremely happy and excited about something. It's water under the bridge. This means something happened in the past and you have moved on from it. I am on cloud nine. This means you are extremely happy. It's a shot in the dark. This means something is, is a guess or a chance with no guarantee of success. It's not the end of the world. This means something is not as bad as it may seem. That's the icing on the cake. This means something is an added bonus or something extra that makes a good thing even better. I am walking on sunshine. This means you are extremely happy and everything is going well. It's a win-win situation. This means both parties involved will benefit or come out ahead. It's a piece of cake. This means something is very easy to do. That's the last straw. This means something is the final thing that pushes you to your limit or makes you angry. It's a work in progress. This means something is not yet complete but is being worked on. I am pulling my hair out. This means you are extremely frustrated or stressed or stressed out about something. Here are 50 plus advanced phrases for English conversation. I couldn't agree with you more. That's a valid point. I see what you mean. I am of the same opinion. It's a matter of perspective. Frankly speaking, I think I am inclined to believe if you don't mind my saying so to be perfectly honest. Correct me if I am wrong. But it's worth considering. To put it another way, on the other hand, I take your point, but that's a fair assessment. It's not as simple as that. I see your point, however, with all due respect. I I take issue with that. I respectfully disagree. Allow me to play devil's advocate. That's a, that's a bit of a stretch. I beg to differ. That's a common misconception. It's a tricky subject. I am on the fence about this. That's an interesting perspective. It's a tough call. Let's agree to disagree. I am not entirely convinced. It's a double-edged sword. It's a double-edged sword. That's a valid concern. I understand where you are coming from. That's a good point to consider. It's not without its drawbacks. That's a salient issue. That's a fair question. 
it's it's not as straightforward as it seems it's a matter of interpretation i am on the same wavelength as you i think we are seeing the same thing that's a valid objection it's a point worth raising that's that's a moon point that's a moon point that's a valid critique i think we need to look at this from another angle it's a valid consideration that's an astute observation it's a worth exploring further these phrases can help you express your thoughts and ideas in a clear and concise manner during conversation practice using them in your daily conversation and you will soon find that you are able to articulate your ideas more effectively thank you so much i love you all